Hi, good morning, guys. Wish you all very, very happy Diwali from our family to your family. This is not my Diwali new clothes. I've got a lovely kanji viram silk sari which I bought from kanji viram. That's what I'm going to wear today for Diwali. You know, in my childhood, my grandmother and my mom they used to wake us about four o'clock and take head bath. You know, with all the oil massaging and head bath. That's my childhood memory of Diwali. But we are not doing it today. I've done it a few times though, even in London in this cold weather in November. But we are not doing that today. We are starting a little bit of a late. Diwali today because both my kids have gone to riding class. You know, in the pony club, if you go inside and come back itself, you you'll get the horse menu smell on your clothes. So they are going to take head bath after they come home. Pati has taken them to their class. So when they come back, Diwali really starts. I'm going to make breakfast now. I made lots and lots of Diwali sweets yesterday. Whole of two three days I was doing it. Few of my close friends are going to come today for Diwali to celebrate with us. It's going to be such a fun-filled day. Recently, we had a Diwali party. All the Indian community in London, we organized together for a Diwali party. It was so much fun. We had so much of lovely, lovely, yummy food, Indian food, all Indian food. And then we had dance programs. It was so much fun. So if I finish making breakfast now, it is special Diwali breakfast. If I finish making it now, we can distribute sweets to our neighbors and then start our Diwali festivities. Can we go and start on the breakfast? I've already started the breakfast. I'll show you what sweets I have made and everything. Come on. I'm getting the breakfast ready. This is the dal in the cooker for sambar. I'm going to make sambar, idli, vada and everything. Proper South Indian breakfast. These vegetables are for sambar. I've cut some beans, some carrots, tomatoes and everything. And this batter is for vada. I'm making lentil vada. Urad dal vada I'm making. We are not used to elaborate cooking of idli, sambar, vada and everything, chutney and everything for breakfast. But today since it's Diwali, it's special breakfast. I've made coconut chutney for my idli. I'm making two chutneys today coconut chutney and also here I've got something for my coriander leaves chutney coriander red chilies coconut and everything for the coriander chutney and my sambar is almost ready here see it's an elaborate beautiful yummy South Indian breakfast today I'm so happy and we have got idli podi also that I brought from India it's my mother's specialty idli podi as well I now have to make the idli and vada. Crispy, crispy urad dal vada is getting ready. Yummy, yummy vada. My kids just love it. So I make this quite often. You know, even as an evening snack, after school snack, I make this vada. See how beautifully my idli dosa batter has fermented. You know, sometimes it fails also. I had kept the oven light on and inside the oven it was to maintain the temperature, little warmth temperature. But sometimes that doesn't work too. But today it's just beautifully fermented. This is my mom's special idli podi. I've already posted that recipe, but if you haven't seen that video yet, then I'll give the link below this video. It's a very, very, very tasty, yummy idli pudding. We usually put the new clothes for Diwali in the puja room. See, the previous night itself, we kept it last night here. I put some turmeric and kumkum as well. See, this is my Susie's little lehenga. This pretty lehenga, it's very, very pretty. This blue lehenga and the pink lehenga which she was wearing for Diwali party here. I bought them both in Wembley. It's very, very, very cute with all this work. And Pati said just one shirt is enough for him while buying. And this is Sam's, my elder daughter's lehenga. This I bought from India. I didn't buy. Actually, my sister gifted this for her for Diwali. It's kind of a heavy lehenga. See the work. Heavy work. Literally, it's very heavy. <laughs> See the heavy work in the lehenga. It's a lovely lehenga, peach color one. And this is my lovely silk sari. I'll show you when I wear the sari. We distribute sweets and savouries to our neighbours. These are the sweets I made yesterday. I made some Mysore pa. This is homemade Mysore pa. I use my mom's recipe. I don't use ghee in Mysore pa. It's a very, very, very nice recipe. I'll share the recipe with you guys if you want. 
and I made some badusha also, some sewell and this is kaju katli I made, that's my kids favourite. I made a small batch of kaju katli. My kids are going with two plates to distribute to neighbours. Super yummy South Indian breakfast is ready. This is our special Diwali breakfast. Yum yum num num Diwali breakfast. We usually don't eat such a big breakfast. It's not our regular breakfast. We normally eat cereal or porridge or sometimes even smoothie or omelette with small breakfast. A healthy breakfast we get it done with. But today since it's Diwali, I made this big South Indian breakfast. Kids and Pati are eating already. Let's go and join them. Pati, how's breakfast today? Breakfast is fantastic. Very, very nice. You like it? Yeah, yeah. Very nice. Very nice. Very tasty, darling. And everyone, happy Diwali. <laughs> happy Diwali to all of you. See these placemats. Shiny, beautiful placemats. Table placemats. I bought them in Dubai. I think I bought it one and a half years ago in Dubai. I wanted to use it for Diwali. Somehow we didn't use it for last year Diwali. Only this year I'm using. See, I just loved this pattern. It was very, very, very nice. This is a special one. Only today I even opened the pack. It's very nice, isn't it? This is my new Diwali sari. It's a silk sari that I bought in Kanjivaram. Kanjivaram BMK saris. I went to India a couple of months ago. Me and my mom went for shopping there. We always go for silk sari shopping in BMK sarees in Kanjivaram. This is an amazing color combination, isn't it? Silk sari is all about the combination of colors. You know, from my childhood, I always loved this half white combination. Half white sari or pattu pavade with a big border. I just love this half white with this different pink. It's kind of a different shade of pink, isn't it? I just love this sari. My friends are coming for dinner today. Pati has started cooking already because he doesn't let me cook when I'm wearing good sari. You know, silk sari, you have to be very careful in the kitchen. Now, turmeric powder stain will catch very easily. It's very difficult to remove the stain from silk saris. Even oil spillage, anything Indian cooking, you have to be very careful. That's why I already finished cooking breakfast and then draped this sari. Do you like this sari? I just love this. I'll show you what Pati is cooking. Come. Pati, what cooking is going on? Ah, super cooking today. Chicken. Yeah. Chicken. chicken. You're making chicken curry. Curry, chicken curry. Chicken curry. I'm starting with mutter paneer. Paneer. So, uh, mutter yeah, paneer. Mutter paneer. So I'm starting. Yeah, the base. Okay. Okay. And uh, I'm going mm. to do some pulao, right? Pulao also. Yeah. It's Kashmiri, Kashmiri pulao. Kashmiri pulao. <laughs> <laughs> he has already soaked the saffron and from some Kashmiri chapati. pulao. Some rotis also. Yeah. <laughs> I soaked a little bit of saffron in milk. I just dry fried it for a little bit and then soaked it in milk. It has to soak for 10 or 15 minutes. This is for the Kashmiri pulao. Kevin, you have already met her, haven't you? Yes. Hello everyone. Happy Diwali. <laughs> she lives in Holliston, my very old friend. And this is Haley. Happy Diwali. <laughs> Happy Diwali. Diwali to everyone. We are enjoying all the Indian sweets oh, and all amazing. the Indian delicacies. Did you try the samosa? Oh, it's beautiful. Yeah, beautiful. beautiful. Did you try the water? Yes, I haven't yeah. had the samosa yet. I haven't had the samosa. And Sam, Sam took away Sorry. the sweets, so I'm hoping Sam brings the sweets. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Sam, you have to bring the sweets as well. <laughs> that plate you took mm. away, you have to bring it. Mm. Party, what's going on? Everything is ready. You made so many vada here. <laughs> Roti is ready, kachori, paneer, chicken. Is it hot? Yes, it's hot. Okay. Oh, it's cooled down now. Oh, yummy Kashmiri pulao and this is chicken. Oh, see now Gayatri yeah. has also come. Shaya. Yes. Gayatri, so sorry, one yeah. minute. Yes. Gayatri, can you say Happy Diwali? Oh, sorry, Akka. Happy Diwali. Indian Diwali, Nalwartikal. <laughs> <laughs> 
Okay, yeah, good. Inspired by Akka's colors and I wore Akka's colors in Kerala. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Pink, <laughs> pink. See, my pallu is pink and Gayatri is, uh, half sari is pink too. And tried. <laughs> <laughs> tried very hard. <laughs> And are you, are you from Hertfordshire as well? Yeah, so we, yeah, we're in Hertfordshire. Ah. So how long have you known? Have you guys known each other? Many years. Many years. Yeah, since, was Sam seven? Um, six. Oh, she's six. six. No. Yeah. Really? Six yeah. years old? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. She used to go to Ella. Ella. Yeah. 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 Oh, when Sam yeah. was six years old. Yeah. Yeah, so yeah. I started to go to Sam yeah. maybe when she was six or seven then, because yeah. they say she went to my And then first. that time I was pregnant with Susie. No matter what, like, Susie you has to, to come to you. She, you have to look after her. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 And then she used to come to our house to play with Susie and get to know her. So she was comfortable with her. Yeah. That's nice. Yeah. And I've got a daughter, Ella, who were friends as yeah. well. So. Yeah. so we said next time, because Namada came to me a few... Couple of months. Yeah. A month, two months ago, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah month And then four. we've come here, and okay. so she, she couldn't come. So she went yeah. with her friends. Yeah. What's she doing? Um, she's doing six forms, so second year A level. Oh. So she's doing philosophy, sociology, and creative media. Oh wow! That's you know, it feels yeah. like only <laughs> yesterday they were this tiny, tiny chubby, and then they blink. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And they used to wear Pattu Pavade for Diwali, and oh, she used to yeah. do a column with Sam and yeah. Susie. That's so nice. You yeah. know, the color lang- rangoli powder and uh-huh. everything. She used to have fun. And you know, for Seam and them, Susie Seam and them, we did a jedi to her. That long <laughs> hair and flowers wrapped around. Yeah. You know, I still have the photos and Aww. everything. Uh, yeah. So nice. Yeah, yeah. Karen was my sister. Yeah. Yes, my sister. <laughs> That's what she said to me though. Yeah. She, she actually yeah. said to me, you're not my friend. You're not my sister. <laughs> yeah. yeah. It's oh, really, really nice. Somehow you can find someone like that, right? Yeah. It's yeah. really nice. It's, really yeah. hard. it's hard to find connections like that. Yeah. Yeah. Especially when they're looking after your children as well. Yeah. And gratitude. Yeah, he made that picture for me. <laughs> oh, they set the table beautifully here. Thank you. 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 Yeah, yeah, many people are He doesn't eat, but he made chicken for us. Mm. Huh? Wow. Yeah, yeah. Hey! 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 It's nice. Woo-hoo. Let's do a big one. <laughs> moral support is my job. <laughs> I give moral support from here. <laughs> I like to watch yeah. the jits, but I don't like the fun ones. Yes. You can do it. Show us how. Yes. It's lovely. <laughs>